Hey there guys, what is up? It's Connor here, bringing you another Mild Warfare 3 video, and this time, I am playing my all-time favorite game type, TDM, or to dumb, depending depending on your point of view. We had this conversation a little while ago, for those of you guys that remember when I did my dual com with Brian, and he said it was to dumb. I said it was TDM, and we were kind of mixed on the comments about whether is this to dumb or are we playing TDM. Who knows? Who knows? But, you know, whatever. Good arguments. Good times. Good times. We're playing on C-Town using my new favorite, probably, submachine gun, the MP7. I, yeah, 7. And with silencer and rapid fire, I keep blowing into my mic, and it's like burning my eardrums. And some silencer and not rapid fire, you liar. And extended mags running with the predator the ah6 overwatch or a over h6 yeah we're going with six we're going with six and the pave low but my first pave low guys my first pave low does some work and then they're like we ain't having none of this we ain't having none of this pave low flying around just dominating all of us we gonna shoot this stuff out of the sky so they take it out and yeah now <laughs> yeah depressing depressing yeah well one thing I gotta say is, guys, I gotta tell you this right now, right up front, I gotta be serious with you guys. I actually die three times in this video. <gasps> Connor, three times and you're only putting two? Yeah, well, listen to this. I was right around the 40 and 2 mark, maybe 37 and 2 to 40 and 2, somewhere in there, and a guy blows me up with Dead Man's Hand. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? So we do not count that as a death. I I personally don't count that as a death. Now, if you guys want to go down and troll down in the comments and be like, Connor, you went 41 and 3, not 41 and 2, please do it. I will not be offended whatsoever. But I don't count it as a death. Hopefully, you won't count it as a death, and hopefully, you'll enjoy this gameplay. So I actually hadn't played barely. I had probably 10 games of Team Deathmatch in, like regular 6v6 Team Deathmatch in before um, this like before this video and I was like dude I need to get back in this this stuff is fun I love me some team deathmatch people don't seem to shoot down my air support all the time as quickly it's just a better game flow it's more fun you guys can't yell at me for not winning the game because I win oh I will win almost guaranteed I will win all the team deathmatch games I post because I don't know just going 41 and 2 it's kind of hard to lose but never know you always get those random teammates on your team that they're they're playing split screen and the one guy's going like 4 and 13 and the other guy's going like 0 and 22 you always get those guys so so yeah those guys are just wonderful but anyways I I don't know I'm kind of in this kind of stuck between what I want to play because you guys everybody seems to be putting up these 100 kill games and they're like 104 and 9 or 115 and 10 and it's like yeah they got a ton of kills but their KD is only 10 I mean they only got a 10 KD which is I mean it's fine but it's not like crazy good like I mean this is a 20 KD I'll have one out later at 17 something and if I wouldn't have died twice I'd be pretty <laughs> I'm sure I'll be able to get a good 40 KD here eventually in this team deathmatch stuff and so personally I like to keep I like to play 6v6 more than ground war because ground war is just a ton of spam air support air support spam all that mumbo jumbo but I like the 6v6 stuff the straight up team deathmatch domination and I like to go 50 and 2 60 and 3 37 and 2, 41 and 2 as in this game. Because I just think, I think the high KD kind of brings out, I don't know, it just kind of showcases a different skill level. Now, it may not, it's not, now going 4 and 0, oh, no, not 4 and 0, oh, going 15 and 1 and saying you have 15 KD, no, that's, that's retarded. I mean, I understand that. But going like 104 and 10 or something, that's a 10 KD. I don't know, guys. What, what, do you, what do you guys think on this? Do you think KD is better or getting a ton of kills, like going like this and getting a 2 KD where I get over half the team's kills or where they go and play ground war domination and they end up with 100 kills and 10 deaths and a 10 KD? Which would you guys rather see? Because, I mean, I've never actually really tried for a 100 kill game, like legitly actually tried. So, I don't know. I could probably... I'm sure I could get it eventually. I'd hope so. So, what what do you guys like? Do you guys like this team deathmatch stuff like this where I'm just rushing around, getting tons of gun kills, my payloads doing some work, and that was weird. I shouldn't... I, yeah, I shouldn't do that. <laughs> um, and... 
Pavlo's doing work and just getting some gun kills, you know, staying alive, getting 20 KD. Which one Which one would you guys rather see? The 100 kills or the 40, 40 kill TDM, 50, 60 kill um, domination and getting, like, the higher, the 15 plus KDs, 15, 20. What, yeah, just let me know what you guys would rather see. I mean, I'll probably, when I play Ground War with Brian and Logan, I'll probably... I'll go for some higher kill games, of course, and maybe be able to throw out a mix of both. I just need your guys' opinion here because it's you guys that matter, not me. Who cares what I want to do? I'm going to do what you guys want to do. For example, I'm still trying for that stupid PM9 Moab. And yesterday, I actually had four four games in a row of a 15 kill streak with the PM9. 15 on the money and then died. So that was, that was disappointing. But I've now died twice on a 23 kill streak with it and had... Yeah, some four, uh, 15 kill streaks going on, guys. But once I get that out of the way, I'll be done with the submachine gun Moabs for a little while until I try to go get like a double MOAB or a really fast one. But then I'll move on, try to get some shotgun ones, maybe. Yeah, just go through the assault rifles and the shotguns and get out plenty, plenty of MOABs plus some gameplay like this because I know everybody wants to mix it up. It, YouTube, I heard a good one. YouTube is now MOAB too, or. MOAB tube or Moab tube because everyone's just throwing out Moabs. So I want to keep it real, keep it legit, get some 41 and 2s, do all this good stuff. And so I hope you guys enjoy. This video will be over here shortly. So thanks for coming, checking this stuff out. Hope you guys have a good day. Go go check out my MOAB class for those of you guys trying to get some MOABs. Got a good class setup video and I'm sure hopefully it'll help you guys and Hopefully you'll enjoy it. My mic, it doesn't sound like I'm chewing on my mic this time like it did in my nuke video. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'd like to thank you all for watching it. And I will see you guys when I see you. Adios.